Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm going to give a shout out to the Philippine military, particularly the Philippine Coast Guard and the Philippine uh, Army. They rescued a hostage named Lorenzo Tito. I mean, he's an engineer aboard a boat, and the boat got seized by Abu Sayyaf, and the and some, some people aboard the boat got kidnapped, but Lorenzo Tito um, was not executed, and people did not have to pay him ransom neither. The Philippine army had overran a key Abu Sayyaf position in the southern Philippines, and Abu Sayyaf had to abandon Lorenzo Tito. So Lorenzo Tito uh, is in decent health and was being treated at a Philippine military hospital, and... God bless the Philippine Army and the Philippine Coast Guard. The Philippine Coast Guard uh, supplied the boats and some of the troops, and then the Philippine Army supplied the rest of the troops. And they went in, and they got Lorenzo Tito, and they rescued him. And Abu Sayyaf is on the run, thanks to these brave soldiers. And yes, we need to recognize what the U.S. soldiers are doing in the fight against ISIS and the fight against terrorism, but the Philippine military is also fighting against radical Islamic terrorism, and in this case, is at their front door. And Abu Sayyaf is tied to al-Qaeda, and they're tied to ISIS, so... Good job, Philippine military. You guys are the good guys, so you can keep it up. Hope everyone's doing well. Take care. God bless and bye-bye. Bye-bye.